The city of Rochester held their first ever National Day of Racial Healing. During the event, city leaders signed a charter that they hope will curb racial inequality within the community. Josh Navarro has the story on this. Let's get real is the message coming out today from the city of Rochester during their first ever National Day of Racial Healing. Mayor Lovely Warren hopes that getting local government involved in community conversations and have public policy in place will dismantle discrimination. Today, we take the first step in what I expect to be a long journey, a journey that will make Rochester a better, stronger community, a community that allows each and every one of us to fulfill our potential and contribute to a greater good. According to Warren, the city of Rochester is in the 15 bad cities for African Americans to live in due to poverty. And she says something has to be done under her watch. The city proposed this charter that will focus on four areas that will help solve racial inequality. They include workforce planning that will ensure employees and senior management to complete trainings on diversity, racial equity, and inclusion. Grantsmanship will expand local anti-poverty initiatives. Community powerment's aim is to dismantle systemic racism and media engagement, which includes workshops to further discuss the racial divide and language with media leaders. It's more we get out in the community and start helping people to let them understand what are some of the terminologies that we're using, um, racial equity, what does it mean? Structural racism wasn't to me. Institutional racism wasn't to me. I mean, we have to begin to, to peel back the layers. And then once we peel back the layers, we have to acknowledge the fact that some of these things have happened. And then we have to work on healing. And how do we, as, as a community, come together and be unified as opposed to dividing? This initiative is backed by the National League of Cities. In Rochester, I'm Josh Navarro, News 8. Josh, thank you. The National Day of Racial Healing started in 2016 in part by W.K. Kellogg Foundation as part of its Truth Racial Healing and Transformation effort.